G'day everyone, it's TJ Gibbs currently from Down Under with another YouTube video. This is an unboxing of the Red Dragon Siren 2 7.1 channel surround sound um, headset. Um, got it from eBay. They, they sell for $50 to $51 Australian. And it, this one came from Hong Kong. And what surprised me, it only took like five six days from Hong Kong to come to Australia free posters and posters and handling so it was really surprising and um had this metal band actually it's quite strong I'm surprising about the build quality got better build quality in some other headsets I've had especially a lot better than Tilda Beach because I've had Tail Beach, um, all the Tail Beach headsets from from the mid range to the high end range, and that that crap pill quality. And um, and some other headsets are terrible build quality. That costs five, four to five times dearer than this. Like two hundred to three hundred headsets, dollar headsets. I've tried and they have not good build quality as this. Very comfortable to wear, and um, the sound quality is actually quite surprisingly good. It has a bass thing, vibration thing they called. Don't jump to it, it's like because it, it's too much bass, it doesn't distort the speakers in there, but it makes your whole freaking head almost vibrate. You can feel your cheeks. I mean vibrating it's oh. so I turned it down I turned the ba bass down a bit it's just on that thing it's got a little toggle switch to turn it down but surprisingly it has some highs there like some real cheap headsets or a lot of headsets some of the highs are not there the mic is actually quite good quality mic in it it is um But it will pick up every bit of noise around you. It, but it does sound quite good actually, the mic. And um, the mic can be muted on the little control pad thing that's on the Brady cable on the headset. You can turn the volume up and down on it as well and that vibration. But I would recommend don't have the vibration bit up too loud. A lot of bass a lot of bass but it's too much vibration so your whole almost your head vibrates so but there it's got some highs there it's not too bad the mids are not too bad but most surprisingly the bass is not com not muddy complete mud like a lot of headsets have where the bass the bass is complete mm, oh, muddy and uh, so I highly recommend buying it for fifty dollars, fifty one dollars Australian. I think they're roughly going for on eBay. That's roughly thirty four, thirty five dollars American. So if you want a cheap headset, that's low cost, doesn't cost that much, quite good quality. The mic's good, sounds good, just picks up everything, and all right, pretty good build quality, especially for such a cheap headset. That's better than a lot of headsets I've tried at about a hundred dollars and two hundred dollars and more. Is um buy it and I'll leave a link in the description from the person I bought it for. I think he was called he was called CBT Nerd. And it only took five five six days from to get here, so which is really good, especially coming to Australia from Hong Kong or any other country to Australia. Who lived out down under in Australia or even New Zealand know how long it does take to get some stuff from overseas and if you like the video um, please leave a like and leave a comment down below and I'll get to you as soon as possible peace out yeah.